that will move us over to the other Friday bowl game, Friday, December 17th at 5 p.m. Central Time. And that would be the Tail Greeter Cure Bowl with Northern Illinois and Coastal Carolina. Coastal currently a 10.5 point favorite. The bowl gifts here long sleeve, dry fit t shirt, flex fit performance hat, deluxe duffel bag, and wireless power bank, and then an ice shaker bottle. So uh, basically just a uh, scene on TV section just tossed into a bag and, uh, and handed to them from, uh, from what I can tell. This is, look, Northern Illinois has gotten me multiple times this year. Their coach, Thomas Hammock, retweeted you and I, and it, and it was me basically bad-mouthing Northern Illinois at the beginning of the season. They are the second youngest FBS team in college football. Like, that is bananas to me, and the recruiting classes were not exactly great. Like, nobody expected this out of this team this year, but the coaching staff that he's put together has put together some incredible game plans so far this season. Coastal Carolina has been putrid as a favorite this year. Like, they, whenever they go up against anybody with a pulse, uh, which, by the way, uh, according to ESPN, Coastal Carolina's strength of schedule, number 130. That, that's out of 130 teams. So they haven't really played a ton of great teams this year. Uh, but when they do, they don't seem to cover. Northern Illinois, I think, can run the football on them a little bit. Now, Northern Illinois also may not have seen anybody like their defensive line. But I, I tend to believe that this one will be a little bit closer than the experts think. I, I think Northern Illinois plus 10.5 is the go for me because – uh, like I said on the BetUS show, they ain't getting me again. I, I will I will ride with them this time. I knew that was going to happen. I knew you were going to get guilted into doing that. As soon as I saw this was the game, I thought, there's no way he's publicly going to bet against Northern Illinois. You know I, I bet against them with, uh, against with Kent Illinois. State. Like, I bet against them in the, uh, in the MAC championship game, and they blew out Kent State, like destroyed them. Yeah. You know what Kent State ain't got? They ain't got a defensive front like Coastal Carolina. Okay, right. I love Jamie Chadwell. You know that. I think this defensive front is pretty damn good. I think this might be the best defense Northern Illinois plays all year. I'm curious to see how they handle that. Uh, I don't like laying big numbers in bowl games. We just talked about why, because I think there's a whole lot of give a damn factor in this. So I will, I will, but I'm going to do it. I'm going to lay it. Uh, I love Jamie, and uh, he's my guy. And and until I have a reason to ride uh, away from him, I'm riding with. Him. All right, I can get it. I can get it. So, Coastal minus the 10.5 here. Uh, again, this is Northern Illinois coming from DeKalb, uh, Illinois, excuse me, down to Orlando. So, yeah, it's another one of those situations like uh, coming from Toledo down to the Bahamas, right? Thanks for listening to the Winning Cures Everything podcast. The website is winningcureseverything.com, and if you want to connect with us, we're on Twitter, at GaryWCE, at Chris B. Giannini, at Winning Cures, or you can email us, Gary at winningcureseverything.com or Chris at winningcureseverything.com. Subscribe everywhere you need to subscribe, and we'll see you soon.